hello guys welcome back to my channel thank you for always stopping by liking commenting and subscribing for the new ones don't forget to like comment subscribe turn on notification bell so that you'll be notified and when i drop the next update on twist of fit stay tuned on today's episode ria tells she couldn't sleep at at night and doesn't think Prachi is like Pragya. She didn't leave the house. She's still in the house. She's acting like a good valued pal. She promised Vikram that she'll make Palavi's birthday memorable. Ali asks her to calm her mind and not think of anything of such. Rhea feels just Palavi has kept a distance with Prachi. Ali asks her what's the point. Rhea asks what kind of aunt she is. Ali asks her to talk with manners. Rhea tells Prachi will become everyone's favorite plan and plans to frame Prachi, that the latter was planned to kill her on the pretext of decoration, that Prachi made a big mistake staying back and now she would pay a very big price, that she would cross all the limits this time. Dida overhears them and questions Rhea. Ali and Rhea fool her. Dida gives her the ladies that's beneficial for Rhea in her pregnancy. Rhea thanks Dida and takes her blessings. After Dida leaves, Rhea tells she doesn't want this disgusting ladoos. Alia stops her from trashing the ladoos. Rhea tells it's not a tough task to fool Dida. Dida tells Shana that nobody can fool her. Shana asks her why she feels that Rhea is planning against Prachi. Dida tells she made ladoos for Prachi and also gave some to Rhea. She heard Rhea saying all limits that will be crossed that she li lied did and Shana decide to protect Prachi from Rhea and Alia's evil plans they want to stay with Prachi as a shadow when the party begins Rambi is happy to see Prachi's smiling face he stares at her while Rhea stares at him with a plan Rhea wants to use her baby to get close to Rambi and tells Alia that Rambi is looking at her and smiling Alia finds Rambi looking at Prachi with love Dida and Shana keep an eye on Rhea they want Rhea to accept the truth that Rambi loves Prachi Dida tells Shana that Stanley is always after Rambi Stanley loves Rambi Shana tells everyone loves Rambi Dida tells Stanley is in interested in Rambi. Shana tells Rambi just loves Prachi. Rambi reminds Stanley their plan for the party. Rambi goes after Prachi. Rhea doesn't know what Rambi sees in Prachi. Rambi tells Prachi the juice is testing really terrible. She doesn't believe it. He asks her to try it. She drinks the juice and tells that it tastes good. Rambi tells he would make someone else drink it and testify. She tells he can't serve this leftover drink. He replies he would have it and calls Prachi cute. Prachi thinks if the baby is naughty and dramatic like Rambi, then it would be tough for her to handle the baby. Rambi performs in the party for his parents. Prachi joins him and this upsets Rhea. Rhea corners herself to shed tears. Alia consoles her. The guest praise Rambi for his amazing business and dance skills. Rambi tells he can't take the credit himself, that Prachi is his life partner. She deserves the credit. Palavi stops Rambi and tells him that he always jokes such jokes that such things he will soon become a father of Rhea's child. Prachi was his first wife, but now Rhea is his wife. She doesn't want to talk of his past. Rhea wants Prachi not out of the house and gets executing her plan, tells Alia that she got a, an idea to frame Prachi as someone who wants to harm her baby, shares her idea with Alia and tells they make the fake wall tumble down and then blame Prachi. She wants the entire family to get against Prachi. Alia asks her to stop chanting about her baby. Rhea tells she can't spoil her figure by planning her pregnancy, which means she's not really pregnant. She plans her miscarriage to blame Rambi and sink him in guilt. She does an impressive drama and tells Rambi would never leave her because of his guilt. She explains her plan to Alia. Prachi remembers Rambi's words and feels upset. Rambi reaches her, watches her from the door. Prachi sees the baby bedding and shares herself and tells the baby will really like it. Rambi smiles watching her. Prachi tells she would give the baby bedding to Rhea for her baby that Rhea looks good when she smiles happily but she doesn't get happy easily that she'll make Rhea happy both the babies should stay together with love she wants the babies to have a good bed bonding Rambi gets happy seeing Prachi Prachi turns to see Rambi but he hides Rambi runs out of the room and tells their baby will get their love for sure Balavi tells it's her birthday but everyone is congratulating Vikram Vikram tells that Rambi has worked hard for his project so everyone is giving him the wishes Rambi hears Vikram talking about the dream project and goes to Stanley and tells it's time to go to Vikram and lie to him about the good up that Vikram would think his business is sinking the dream project will not get fulfilled. The Vikram will throw him out of the company and also the house. The Vikram will know the, the truth after two months. Then he would come back home with Prachi. Stanley goes to tell Vikram that Rambi is calling him to the room. Palavi thinks Rambi is calling him. Rambi rehearses to shock Vikram and expects Vikram to oust him. He wants to shift to the old house with Prachi. Get ready to get slapped by Vikram and gets into a serious mood. Palavi and Vikram come. She asks Rambi why he called with Vikram. 
Rambi tells him he has called Vikram to give him a bad news. He lies about the dream project that he has made a big mistake. The project will not get completed now. Vikram is shocked to know this. Palavi asks him if he's joking. Vikram tells him he's really serious. Rambi tells the project can never start. He should just forget his dream. His dream is totally shattered. Vikram asks him to shut up and slaps him and asks Rambi how he can say this so casually. He doesn't want to see Rambi's face and asks him to just go away. Rambi apologizes to him and tells him sorry and won't help them either. Vikram asks Rambi if he went mad or he's drunk. Rambi tells him he isn't drunk. He was in stress. He was drunk and working on the project, so he made those mistakes. Palavi asks Rambi if he lost his mind. How can he say so? Rambi asks her to explain to Vikram that he's overreacting. Vikram and Palavi ask Rambi to get out. Rambi happily goes out, thinking they will throw him out of the house now. Pachi gets the gift for Ria and tells Shana that she wanted to give to Ria. She's the master of Ria's baby. Rambi wants Pachi to wait for a while, then they will be together. Stanley asks Rambi about his love. Rambi tells love isn't enough, it just happens. He recalls Vikram's slaps and tells Stanley that he had got slapped by Vikram. Vikram tells Palavi everything got ruined in a moment. His dream project got destroyed before the start. He apologizes to her. She apologizes to him and knows it was his dream project and he had worked really hard and feels bad for him. He asks her not to spoil her mood. They shall go out and enjoy the party. She cries and tells she can't act in front of the guest. He asks her to forget everything, that it's a special day. He feels shattered, but they can't disappoint those who came to celebrate with her. He asks her to ignore whatever happened. He misses Sid. He would have helped him in such a crisis. His words shock Palavi. Alia tells Ria that Pachi is coming. Ria asks Pachi to just go away and not disturb them. Pachi tells Ria she's leaving the house in the morning and gives a gift to Ria for her baby. Ria tells she'll check the gift when she doesn't see Pachi in the house. Ali asks Pachi if she's playing a trick again. Ria tells she doesn't even want to talk to Pachi and leaves the gift there and goes away. Pachi knows Ria is upset with her, doesn't feel bad, and tells that she would very soon go away from the Collie Mansion. Stanley and Shana collide and argue again. He asks her to become his friend. Thank you guys for watching today's update on Twist of Fate. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, and stay tuned for more updates. Bye.